Hello everybody and welcome to Smith Davidson Gallery in Amsterdam. Today is the first video we're shooting during this COVID-19 crisis. And today is the final day of our exhibition flat out by Paul Rousseau. So we will be taking a special look at his artworks. Uh, Paul Rousseau is an artist from uh, Charlotte, North Carolina. And we've been working with him for the last five years. He's known for his technique called flat depth. And what Paul does is he takes flat items like money, paper money, newspapers, magazines, and then he creates three-dimensional objects. These objects are meant to be monuments for future reference for the generations after us who won't even know what a newspaper, a magazine, or paper money is. For instance, my son who just turned 12, maybe seen a couple of newspapers in his life, but his children will not even know what it is. And the only place where they will be able to see a newspaper, as we know of our lifetime, will be in museums or in collections. Pieces of art probably made by Paul Rousseau. And here we have another work uh, from Paul Rousseau in this exhibition. And the interesting thing about this artwork is it's, this time it's a magazine. It's a catalog really from uh, works by Roy Lichtenstein, famous pop artist. And the interesting thing is that Roy Lichtenstein will use works by other artists, previous artists, and make copies of them in a different technique. And now Rousseau has done the same with works of Lichtenstein. So it's an artist making copies of other artists' works, and then getting other artists makes works of his works. Um, as you can see, compared to the newspaper works by Rousseau, by using different techniques and different chemicals, the texture of this artwork is completely different. And it looks like a full glossy catalog magazine. And this time, the magazine has been made into a eternal monument for future reference. 